Yeah, so everyone's running, everyone's running all the time. So once again, trying to do more positive videos, no cash, we have better support at home. But I want to end this on a mad, mad positive. It'd be nice, no cash today. Which is very rare for your boy, okay? So, to the young goddess, message to the young men who feel a threat, and message to, to, the, to the women who are scared that, you know, we're an endangered species. Mm -hmm. If we go gone, I know you're gonna miss us. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. What's mm -hmm. your message, Joe? Yeah, yeah, Say, energy never lies. Yeah, let me see how you look, you know, you Always rely on energy <laughs> and like I said, with reflections. You know, be aware of your surroundings and really, you know, trust your instincts. And whatever you say, like I said, when you say in harmony, use wisdom. Wisdom is a very, very important thing to you. So be wise within your thoughts and within your energy and actions. With the linguistics and etymology, I picked up what you're saying differently to some other people. How they heard. So you didn't say yeah. reflection. You said raw reflection. Yeah, rasta, yeah, bro. Raw reflections. Yeah. You know like when people say sudden? Yeah, Rasta, yeah, Bobo. I don't be saying sudden, I'll be like, yo, raw. Oh, fuck me, yeah. fuck me. So break down why you said <laughs> raw flexions. Raw flexion meaning the sun. So sun, oh. sun raw, so that's it. I'm messing, I'm messing. And the sun is inside me. Are you a girl? And you. Are you a girl? Well, put it there. The wall of them and 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 the wall of them. Don't compromise the integrity of your divinity. I'm not joking, I'm sure you are. Rasta, man. I'm going to say it's a mother girl. I'm going to say it's a mother girl. Give me the camera because he's not. It's not on it, it's not on it. No, I was recording. No, 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 but no, no it was. It's, it's breaking on something positive. No, it didn't. You're letting yourself be distracted. No, man. It Go was. ahead, now have your conversation. Set. <laughs> no, <laughs> set. Never ever. It's again. recording, bro. <laughs> so, we ended it out. so we ended it like that. In fact, I'm on a break. Positive words, I'm on a break. Breaking <laughs> down for you and all that. Like, what's it though? Yep. Don't get, don't get violent. Don't get sad, get mad, yeah. get mad, um, get mad constructively. Right? So, like, what's the name of Constructively. Like, go do your research, get books. I've been telling people all the time, they're like, what do you mean? I'm like, well, you're in Europe, it's no longer the so-called EU or whatever. I was like, study international law. The amount of books I got is untrue. But they tell you that reading is, is, is for dunks. How can we be, reading is fundamental. Pick up a book, man. Like, do something for the people who came before you. Whether it's Marcus Garvey, Harriet Tubman, Martin, Malcolm, Lover. You should be reading. You should be checking these things for yourself because the BBC and ITV don't owe you a damn thing. CNN and Sky don't owe you a damn thing. And you learning this. You yourself to go and research what's really going on in the world. And learning this self world. improvement. Like, realize the real lie, your real lie. Don't just go by your two physical eyes, you know what I'm saying? That's an illusion and delusion. Definitely. Don't find, deluded or deluded. find out what's going on. Don't just accept the news version of things. You know what I'm saying? The news will tell you, oh, brother put on uh, a Deshanky and I put up a fist. God damn, if I wear the Deshanky out here and I can manage Deshanky, what, you gonna shoot me too? Am I gonna, you gonna go away and say, if I die tonight, you gonna say, I was negative and I'm, you don't know I'm not about that. You don't know I'm down for everybody. I get Europeans, Orientals, everybody come here and just know the job. You know what I'm saying? So we gotta be an example of Alexandra, like when they took down the rules of the library, now people are coming and tuning into us. Right. That's, that's the flip side of gentrification. Yeah, right. Because Sebastian and Sarah, who previously lived in Kansas and Chelsea, with their 500 pound a rent, a uh, week rent, they can't afford that no more. So now they move to areas like this, Harringay and Uptown, and Harlem and Brooklyn, and Bridgeton and Peckham, and Harlem, you know what I'm saying, and Moss Island, Tuxley. They really want to get to know us now. What can you do, like, turn them away because of the, the compression? You can't do that, can you? No, that's not, not right. So they really want to know. This is like the first time they really got so close to people of color. The last time they got so close to people of color was when they was running checking field in your school and you outraced them. Or yep. when you was cleaning their house as a janitor. You know what I'm saying? Or you was a skivvy at their work. Yeah, no, we're not got it. Now they're being forced up town. No, they're living next to you. They're not coming with no manners. They, they simply like, they want to know, like, damn, these people are thinking so bad after all. They're not even violent. They're just doing their thing. Like, why do people listen to it? You dig me? Yeah. So the whole racism thing, as we said, is a scam. Although racism and white supremacy does exist. But racism right. and race does not exist. That's all financial, it's all economical. The whole slave thing is a, is a myth because we're not real slaves, you know, it's the Slavics, although the trade didn't happen. But it's a trade. Look at the word trade. Trade is economical again. So you really gotta know your thing before you start jumping these out. We items. migrated around the world Jump. before that. Yeah. Exactly. Exactly. Simple. In all, all parts. Yeah, all America parts. For this guy called Columbus, even came. Yeah, before. The Queen of the Bell of China, Spain, and Portugal. Who's already there? Look, if Gang gets. We never know cannibals in the Caribbean. If Gang gets caught. If Gang gets caught, circled the earth. Yeah, me. But we did it before, and then you find Native Americans in America who have a complexion that's in between both of them races. What do you think happened? Study their hair. Yeah. Why is it hollow? They yeah. showed you that they, they mixed in with us, pre Shushin Dynasty. The Chinese came walking over the Bering Strait and separates yeah. the United States, Soviet Russia. Yeah. United States, Soviet Russia. That's exactly where I'm coming that's from, my 14, brother. 14 mile gap. 
they came in and walked in, Chinese, mixed them with us, and we were already there playing basketball and, and bringing drums and all that. This is the jazz folk, most cases. They mixed them with us, they might be down south. I said, hey, it's a combination, it's hollow. I have nine ether, look, it's yeah. crown. So the goddess is crown. Yeah. Right. right. That's how it works. Energy, that's a change. It's like real power. Don't compromise the world. Divinity. This is got like a million hairstyles. It's exactly. crazy when people come to me like, yeah, but you don't understand. I, I do understand your yeah, ear. Yeah. Like, you don't need to compromise it for work and all that. But work for yourself. Like, why are you working for them? Why are you trying to work for somebody else, man? This. If you're earning 200 bucks a week, right, then you're earning your man 2,000. You're earning his boss 2 million. Trust me. It's for yourself. It's so simple. The people make things complicated. Did all of them come? Definitely. All of them. I dig. Me, I'm an artist. Listen to this. I'm an artist. And it's funny because I actually was working in fashion and I took out of it to be to work for myself. And I'm a, you know, a musician. I'm an artist. And I'm oh. a poet as well. So, okay. you know, I'm going for what I'm doing. That's it. That's it. Yeah. So when you went to art school, who was your influence? My influence would be, um, like I said, my art is really based on the nature. Um, Artist-wise, I do like uh, an artist called Frida Kahlo and um, the reverse. So everything is inspiration to me. <laughs> I got a close um, artist, artist as well. Yeah, yeah. 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 Orlando, I'll put you on next to the camera. You've seen her in the video, she's spoken. She's a little bit. She's kind of stuck. So I love artists and all that. I always want to know like what inspired them. What music inspired you? Mm -hmm. I like jazz. I like funk. Um, I like blues. I like soul. And I, I love, love, love Jimi Hendrix as well. You know, I'm jazz funk related. That's it. I love my soul and I funk. I do all that old school. As a roller skater, I'm getting back to my skates. Yeah, I do all that soul train. One thing, me personally, I've never ever, I didn't get Hendrix, I didn't get guitar, that's that's why I didn't get the high pitch and all that, I didn't get people taking certain drugs, cocaine or whatever, because I didn't take drugs my whole life, the only thing I done was smoke trees when I was younger, when it was nice, but today it's not, okay, it's all chemicals, so I never got what Hendrix was about, so I don't get it. Can you explain Jimi Hendrix? Because I don't get Jimi Hendrix. I didn't even get Prince. I didn't get Prince. Don't know. I can name you one tune. I can't name you one tune. Not even Purple Rain. Well, that's famous. <laughs> I never Come on. The tune. I just Come didn't on. get what Prince was about. No, 1999. Come on. You know what I mean? I didn't, I didn't get none of that. Prince got some tunes. Numerology, 1999. I'm down numerology. I'm down for that. But I just didn't get what Prince was about. Me personally. I'm not saying he's a bad guy. I'm just saying me. I didn't. I couldn't warm towards a guy like Prince. I understand. I, I understand. Warm towards a guy like um, Jimmy Hammond. I understand. I understand. Everybody said, yeah, Jimmy Hammond, Jimmy Hammond. I can't call you one tune. It just wasn't me. You know, I can talk about Barry White all day. I can talk about his wife, Love Unlimited, Pentagrass. Come on. Jimmy, Barry, Barry Jimmy, White, Jimmy Hendrix is. The Isley Brothers, Jimmy, Yo, Jimmy Hendrix, Grass, Jimmy Hendrix, ten thousand volts, of John Holt, Bob Marley. I can go on in. You know, your boy gets down, but I can't name you one tune. Jimmy like, Hendrix is, is the key example of a black man vibing out with a guitar, like showing you how black men vibe out. You know what I mean? It's a key example. Key example. How we get in tune with music. So that's not my diss towards guitar. It's just me saying that I couldn't grasp guitar. I'm like I like the bass. I like the. You know what I'm saying? The yeah. Funk. Yeah, yeah, of course. So, the, so the, the guitar, the instrument, the guitar didn't do it for me. It didn't pull my string, excuse the pun. It didn't do anything for me at that time, nor did the violin. You know what I'm saying? Nor did the violin. So that's just me and that particular musical instrument. And mind you, when I was going to school, the teachers didn't want to focus on us playing music. They wanted us out on the track and fell. They wanted us in the ring. They wanted us out doing something. Sport. Yeah. Exactly I what I suffered. In hindsight, I wish I could have gone back and be like Saravan or those people with the jazz and learn the saxophone. And I wish I would have learned that. Your children know me like I love you well, the, the, the musical instrument you can learn right now. I never learned all that. That would have tuned me even more. Even in piano, you can tune yourself in with the piano. Because yep. you know we're out of suit right now with the devil's dress beat. Yep. Speed up the music from 432 to 440 hertz. I'll leave that for another day. So, yep. before, this, before the young goddess goes, the intro about this white noise sound. Um, I spotted some of, some of her jewelry. Which one did I point out? Okay. Yeah, screen, like drop the jazz. Oh, this hand right here. Ego. Yeah. Break down what the ego, up. what the ego means yeah, close to Because people will call certain birds by certain name. We can say phoenix, we can say falcons. Yeah, and you all know about the wings of the falcon. You all know about the ISIS wings, his star. You all know about um, the Horus wings. Yeah. 
So, what does this thing personally mean to you per se? Me, when I think of ego, I think of vision. And, um, you know, when I think of vision, you know, you can look at things in many different aspects. And so the eagle, you know, is a very diverse, um, you know, bird. And so I like to reflect myself with the bird and my visual visions, you know, all of my visions. So. <laughs> and one of my favorite tunes back in the day was uh, by uh, an imagination it's called Nightbird. Nightbird is an awesome tune. Nightbird goes for a lot of stuff, right? And there's different variations of what you're referred to as eagle, phoenix bird, rebirthing itself. You got one particular one called the falcon. Can anybody tell me what's unique about the falcon? Uh, well, I can I can tell you a few things I know, but not much yet. Me. Finn, Finn, what's unique about the falcon? You don't need to put your face on camera, but just come closer. What's unique about the falcon? I forgot already. What's unique about the falcon? Yeah, what's unique about the falcon itself? What's unique about the falcon bird itself? Oh, you gotta revise me on that, bro. I'm gonna just come in and listen to you, bro. What can the falcon do? What can, what, what can the falcon look into at most it can? The sun. The sun, yeah. Straight into the sun. You can see it from such an angle, right? You can see, see it's prey, it's enemy, whatever, from such a distance. So we've all got to be symbolic of the falcon. All those symbols you're wearing are symbolic of something. And something like S-U-M sums up to something as opposed to nothing was nothing. I know not a, I know miss, I know now. Make the symbols you wear symbolic of something. Make them add up. Know why you're wearing them. Know why you're wearing certain colors. Some people, they get dressed in the morning, come out in the afternoon, and nothing goes right for them. Because they just run, they, wasn't, they didn't know, they didn't juice up, they didn't eat for the colors, didn't, you know what I'm saying? They didn't hit the spot. They came out and they got it all wrong. Yes. It's like, what's, what's that oh, old school yeah. comedy movie? Uh, with the Wayne family. I'm gonna give you something. When a guy comes out, he's got big, Big pimp shoes, big, big boots, and you got the fish going around like a fish tank. Remember that old school movie? Yeah, I remember oh. when they give you sucker or something like that. Yeah, and he's walking, he's like, and then it breaks. Yeah, and it breaks. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember that. I remember that. It's like what Alice said. Oh, what well, he had the he had the fish in his shoes or something. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah I remember. And you know, all us people of color, we walk with a theme tune in our head. Oh yeah, definitely. We walk with theme definitely. Tune. You know, I like to walk with a theme tune of, of um, Love Unlimited, um, Love's theme. That's Barry White's wife from them. The, the vocal version, a lot of people don't realize it's a vocal version. So certain times you walk with a certain theme, there's a lot of themes you just walk with. So I don't think you need a Walkman to find out my brain and my lungs and all that. You know, Walkmans are like so old school, so BMX. You don't need that, just put on your own tunes. Walk. That's why I'm to get back on all the skates, because you know, you got that theme and boom. And you're working on your, your cheese, you're working on your second tune. Around. Well, as, as a man that makes music, a lot of times I'm walking around like, with tunes in my head all day, exactly. all day long. It's, 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 there's no, there's no doubt about it. I'm, I'm, I'm humming something that I'm about to make. I'm, 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 I'm thinking about something that I heard like a million times today because I've replayed it a million times because that's the theme tune for today. And uh, so I can, I can relate to that. I can relate. To we gotta retune ourselves in with nature. Follow. So, for all yours are wondering about this goddess. She will be back. I will. She will make her services known. Right. She does with joining. She does with singing. She does with poetry. Yes. Um, she does with artistry. Uh, we can what be your poet. What other things to your, to your I resume? Will. I have my book. You had a question right there? Go ahead. My poetry. Yeah, where can we hear it? Uh, okay, um, on my Instagram. And that is um, O T I V A underscore. I have all my poetry videos there and a lot of my just videos there. On Facebook also? And Facebook, mainly Instagram. Mainly Instagram. Yeah. What, what's the address? What's the ID on Facebook? Um, my uh, Facebook name is Mimi and then my name is Nombres. N-O-M-B-R-E-U-S-E. -E. If um, you're not on, because I don't do social media, do you have a venue that you play at? Or um, well, not at the moment, but um, I will be back here and I will have some more yeah. things to share with everybody. Yeah. So come back and and in the meantime, you all get to find the venue. Yeah, <laughs> Do it and they will come. The we got to come with the answers. Like, I'm I'm find, we ain't got a venue, find I'm the venue. You, can you not write your details down? Yeah, I'll okay. join Instagram for that. Okay, yeah, absolutely. So I'm not on the, the thing, but I'm into another thing I'm going to ask you. You know you got the um, the cross on your finger there, yeah? Me? No, the the ankh, the ankh, the ankh. Ank. Yeah, the ankh. The 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 that's an ankh. The, oh, yeah. the key of life, key of everlasting life. Right, that's an ankh. Right. So you got the female principality. Yeah. Right, so right. Let's, 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 let's close the up on it. The, yeah, when they cut, when they cut the head off. The female, yeah. Right. Hence why you, you say it's a man's role with that female. Male chauvinism. Yeah. European male chauvinism. Out. Okay. I want so to get go the down the, the top bit. Right. Yeah. This is interactive. Somebody else come with the next portion. Anybody? What is this? Yeah. 
Jonas, what does this bit represent? The downward bit. Uh, I'm not sure. Anybody? The, the male. male. The male. Yes. The, the male. The, the female. Phallus. Yeah. Okay, so what does this represent? Anybody? The top bit is supposed to be the female bit. We've done that. We've done well, that. I've... So who's left? The, the, male. the male and the female. The answer is self evident. Yeah. The female gets together with the male. What do we produce? You're going to produce offspring. Yeah. There yeah. you go, in one go. Yeah. So, as we were saying earlier on, when you the key to life. be artists and all that, wearing like four foot crosses, yeah. that's a death symbol. So, people are like, oh, I like Rihanna, yes. or, I like Beyonce. Oh, I'm going to get that same chain. Yeah. I don't realize that there's symbolic. No, the, the yeah. symbol. It's Symbols are symbolic. It's even worse. Jesus pieces. People wear it. But the thing is, like, you can't diss someone for wearing a, a certain um, emblem. Look, this young man just here just come into the picture. He's got a cross on. Now I can't diss him for wearing a cross. He wears his cross for his reason. Yeah. I wear my own for, for, for my reason. I so it means something to me. I've got the higher harvest for a reason. Like, so for instance, this is not against any religion or beliefs. Young man, what does the cross actually mean for you per se? Just the symbol alone. It's so proven. It's, it's, uh, I, it is I tell you yeah. what it is, it's childless and domestic. It's a what? I'm a Catholic. Catholic. I'm a Paddy, yeah? Irish. An Irish, yeah, so that's the Irish man, that's the religion, mate. Right? Yes. That's that's the word it is. They believe in God and they believe Clap in Jesus, them. they believe in like an old lady. They, that's, that's the religion. Check this out, linguists, right? If somebody, if somebody was a, opposed to what you believe in, and they've protested. I'm right in saying they become a Protestant, right? That's how some of your religions came about. That's, that, so, yeah. so he may believe in one thing, somebody opposed him, the they protest the against him. Then you get the word religion, like, protest. Uh, like, means, so yeah, 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 yeah. Simple as that. You see what I'm saying? I'm making yeah. fun of it, but it's real. Like, everyone's trying to get the same goal with a different name. Yeah, yeah, basically, yeah. It's, 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 it's basically, yeah, it's, it's the same thing, like the same as you like that now. Um, that's 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 it means something to one person. And if I like that, that's 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 the way it's like. Or looking at the same thing from different angles. Yeah, but yeah. But what, what the governments, what these governments have done, what these so-called establishments have done, like they separated you from him, him from him, him from her. <coughs> Like separating you from the country. So they got you playing chess when you should be mastering chess. Until you turn around and find it for yourself and say, you know what, I ain't playing your game no more, you silly rabbit. I know what's going on. <laughs> I'm not gonna be governed by your governments. Because who's got the right to govern you? Who can like be governed the government? You, you govern yourself. Well, well, this is not the government. Sometimes you can't take the picture people as well. They do, every day. That's, they take liberties. You but, take the piss in some way. But you know what I say tonight though? You know what I say to that, and this may sound harsh, I'm saying it serves the people's right. Because you're in 2016, there's no excuse for you not finding out what's going on. You're in the information age, you know what I'm saying? Listen, the Piscean age is gone, right? What was that symbol about the fish? Well, check this out, fish are jumping back into the sea. So leave that alone, for God's sake. <laughs> I gotta be in that pun, for God's sake. Yeah, the fish are jumping back in the sea. Dolphins and whales are getting caught in the energy of the, of the Thames River London. Something is happening. Bees jumping off the grid. You know, my favorite insect is the, is the bee and the scatter beetle. Fur mm -hmm. or um, uh, chopra. Bees are dying. Straight up. The bee knocks off the grid. Yeah, straight up. So dying, straight up. Right? Yeah, sign him, sign him. There's a big bee that comes to check me normally right here. He's on it, he's on Big bee comes, checks me, comes and hoovers and lands on my arm. That shows you you're doing something right. Bees can't see you from physical eyes, see you by your light. Like your order. Or your circumcision. So they see you by your light. Okay? So the bees are dropping. Who's pollinating your food? Who's pollinating the earth? Who's pollinating your food? Who's pollinating the whole earth? To breathe even. Come on. Big questions. Big questions. By definition, it's a drug. Send it to zombies, man. Oh, buddy. Forcing transhumanism. And you're following the mainstream. The blind following the blind following the blind. Blinds. You know they said the symbol, right? The hunk, yeah? Yeah, yeah. It's meant to be sort of like Babylonian thing. That's what not. Babylonian. That's all I want because I'm, I'm doing research, but I'm not familiar with it. Because I want to get break, the tattoo. Break down, break, break down the words in, in, in sections, so you know, Babel. Yeah. Right. The Babel means doorway. The L in Aramic Hebrew is what they 
but both to be the most high. So they say in the doorway back to the most high. So you're going back to like Nimrod, you're in the tower, it all starts making sense, you start connecting the dogs, right? Babel. Or Babylon, the doorway to Elyon. Elyon is a higher galaxy. I should even say higher, another galaxy. Uh, the reason I said that is because some of you are flat earth idiots. Mm -hmm. You know, we are here, we're in space. Although some of you are that we're on a flat earth and nothing happening. So ridiculously, like Im yeah. ridiculously impossible. So, so Elyon is a, it just happens to be another galaxy, like Pleiades is another galaxy, and Taurus, Andromeda, Draco. Um, there's so many, man, come on. Y'all know what I'm saying, Pegasus, Sirius, you know what I'm saying? All that, you know, the number thing, one of the two songs, y'all should know that, maybe I'm the free, but one of the two songs right now. So there's no escaping it, y'all feeling what's going on, and the whole galaxy wide, we go down there about the equinox, that's what's happening right now, there's an awakening. But some of y'all can't just grab that, you need to throw Starts with inside out. Well, 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 to, well to, to me, like nobody can't really this the Egyptians sign the ank, you get me? Because really and truly they are the scholars of humanity, basically. The scholars of humanity. They taught the Greeks and everything. They had ast astronomy mapped out before anybody else, before the telescopes even came out. Well, like the Dogans did. Dogans of Mali. That is China or that. Then you get back to ancient Shuma. The, the river, China yeah. Derived so, from, yeah, and they were derived from, yeah. What we gotta do to say to Korea is that we gotta get off of the thing of like saying ancient Egyptians and, and what the, the original Egyptians. Come on, Egyptian is Greek word anyway. You see what I'm saying? It, so when Hebrews are like shouting at everybody saying, yeah, they practiced homosexuality in Egypt, I can even defend them. They did. Yeah. But check this out. They didn't practice homosexuality in Kevin. No, they didn't. Right. So there's a big difference. With different timelines, all this dynasty crap, and that's pre dynastic, and that's the original. Right, Kemet's the original, so we are pre all that. So, although they're taking the, the plate of cheese, well, you ran out of you because I'm trying not to curse today. Yep, but all they're they laughing in your face saying Elizabeth Taylor having a depiction of Cleopatra's jungle. You know what real time it is. What's the latest movie they got now? The gods, guys of Egypt. The gods of Egypt. The gods of Egypt, and you know there's no. no well, there's no black guys in Yeah, there's, there's no, no people color. That don't make no sense. There's no, there's no breaking out of That the don't make no sense. That's that's covering there's up. No there's no Wu There's no nothing. There's no damages that pertain to us or Smith and Hammer. That there is fabricating history. This is the type of rewriting of history that we've suffered for so many years. However, I'd say this, say that. Who's making a movie? Hollywood. And Hollywood cast spells. Literally, the mm. piece of wood they use is Holy Wood. Holy Wood. So they cancel spell. Holy so Wood. They made the movie. They who funded them? Their people funded them. So oh. you can't like skin up, brush your teeth. They made a movie, and none of you are in the movie. So what does it tell you to do? Make your own movie. Right. That's right. It. You know what I'm saying? If, if if you do animations, make your own animations. I saw the other day. I can't even quote it. There was a guy in some part of the motherland. Might be Nigeria. He's a, uh, a definitely person of color. He does animations, and he's got a, a, a animation superhero. In what? The same what, we what we need? What we need? What we need? So any of y'all, I know a lot of y'all, because I was rubbish in school. I wish I was an artist like y'all. I was, I've been doing it myself, but I'm not skilled like that. Some of y'all not skilled like that. Then bring it, bring it. What ain't, what ain't there? Bring it. Like make, make more animations. People of color cartoons. If you're vexed you about, if you're vexed about the so-called Egypt thing, then make a movie. The, the, not even the gods, we don't call ourselves gods, we are the Nafa, the Nafaru, the Nafaru of Kemet. Make a movie called the Nafaru of Kemet. Trust the me. The Nafaru of Kemet, or Kush. Go back to the money for you guys. It does go back to the money, and we don't support each other, which is sad. And we got people in our, in our midst who are actually geniuses when it comes to finance. Claude Anderson is one. Uma Johnson, I don't understand why you're giving them a bad time right now. I don't get it. Yo, am I missing something? He asked for a black school, right? I'm not Uma. I'm only trying to raise 70k to get a store here to be a one-time shop and teach in the shop and do live shows in the shop. So I don't risk the risk of getting arrested out here on the sidewalk. So I'm not Uma. Uma that's for a million and you're saying like, he sat and said, okay, he wants to start from the nucleus first. Only people his complexion can be the teachers first. That's what he's saying, right? So he's saying no Europeans coming first. What's wrong with that? Because if I go a quarter of a mile away from here, you got the district called Stafford Hill. Or you can go to Golders Green. Or you can go to Bensonhurst in Brooklyn. And uh, the, the so-called Jews who purport to be Jews who are not of the same country. They're not really Jews, are they? Yeah, the Jebusites. Yeah. And uh, they got their own school buses. They got all of them, right? The sirens don't go off how they go off around here. Yeah, and trust they me. They don't go off. This trust me. This is the actual they roll up slow on you around so, there. <laughs> so what, what I'm saying is that, like, why are you dissing homeboy? Because he said he wants certain Roll up slow and quiet when you come in the private state. 
You know what I'm saying? What do you want? What do you want the principal to look like you? Because what I know, what I was as I said, when it came to the music class, the, the, the Asian guy didn't want us to know. This is not a disc to all Asians. He didn't want us to know how to learn the music. You want us to be checking for the boxing and trying to compete to each other. We ain't never learned since then. Mathematics as well. Mathematics to me was boring at school because the Asian didn't look out for people like me. So I came out retarded. I didn't learn nothing. The only thing I came out with in school that was good at was English. It's not just that. That's it's the, the way we English. learn. They don't teach us that way. Exactly. And education, usually, and education really is added to the table. Usually, yeah. usually we're actually pretty forward compared to the education system we're put in. Usually we end up so bored that we just give up. You know what What's I mean? this whole thing right now with the abbreviation when they call them children? AD something? ADHD. 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 Right. Now, a lot of y'all not even heard about that to my boy Umar. Umar just seen and broke that down. So, all I'm saying is like, cut the brother some slack. You know of course saying? my attention is going to be elsewhere if you're not that like, fun, if you're not if you're not feeding my actual attention, something. my intelligence, then it's going to be somewhere else. Simple. Yeah. It's a simple thing. Right. Give, a, give a bit of props to his scholarship. I applaud your success. Why? Because it means I too can succeed and I believe in my own brilliance. I'm going to tell that to the next sister and next one who comes along here. I'm not going to put them down. And that's what we're going to come together collectively. So yeah, the financial thing, we're going to start supporting each other first. So if you hear that this lady right here is an artist and all that, and like the brother done, uh, nice question, where does she do these things? What are you going to do? You're going to go and support, right? Them noises. That's what I'm saying. I'm not on Instagram for the site, but if you're the social media, I'll join up. But that's a very but good question there, yeah. On, on, for that reason. No. Yeah. But um, I gotta close this down right now. Yeah, go on, go on. We've run out of time. You've run, time. run so out of time. Fans. But tomorrow we're gonna hit it again. Keep it nice, positive. No one curse today. Get myself around the floor. I didn't even curse the neither. Didn't even I didn't even curse neither. Right. Usually I swear, oh, like. Right. That's good. <laughs> we, kept it, we kept it nice because it's not big and it's not clever. And I apologize. And it's. Let off in, in other videos. Let's, I got routed, but we're going to do some nice. Let's be personal. Positive. Let's be video. personal. Between so before I bounce out, it's all 7 9 feet, 261 Your boy, Brooklyn. Brooklyn, New York. You can donate uh, to my. Uh, my PayPal, my email, doubles up the same thing. Brooklyn in about 2013 at yahoo.com. Hit me up on Facebook, the whole tree stamp. Don't need to be a member, the whole tree stamp. On YouTube, the whole tree stamp. And based on here every day, some assistance on the page for me. And I'm out. What's up? Namaste. Ashe. Whatever you want to call it, just means peace. You know what I'm doing? Before I bounce out, I'm going to to my boy Jammers. Jammers, what's the next event coming up? The speakers come up. I'll be there. Manor House. You turn on the green lane. It's on green lane. The minute you turn on the light, there's a problem. You can't miss it. Getting us to communicate with our differences. And the group come and see me. When we go to the 9 to 5, we can put our differences away and work for them. When we when we see products like Adidas or Puma, we forget about our differences and invest in them. But when we want to come together, all of a sudden our differences count. So I'm so we're saying is let's work together, just like put, we build our own things. We can always argue after when we've got food, when we've got buildings, we can argue about our differences afterwards. So basically, what we're doing and working with Robert here is, 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 is to hire intelligence. It's our time now to work for ourselves, do for ourselves. And we out. See you on the other side. <laughs> yeah.